Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel with me, your host, Chunny. I thought I would uh, get us into an Undertale Let's Play, considering Undertale's been doing so well and you guys have been giving me so much good feedback on the VR chat stuff. We'll be getting back to that at some point soon, I just need to get some models made. But, with no further ado, here we go. Long ago, two races ruled over the Earth, humans and monsters. One day, war broke out between the two races. It's pretty, uh, pretty typical story as far as RPGs go. After a long battle, the humans were victorious, of course, as most of the legends in all games say. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Ooh, how about them apples? Many years later. Mount Ebbet, 21X. You find yourself just running around and having some fun. Legends say those that uh, climb the mountain will never return. So let's go and challenge those legends, shall we? As most dumbass kids usually do. <laughs> oh snap! We tripped on a root! What fate! And tumble down the hill we go. Ah. And falling onto what seems to be a bed of flowers. Look at that. Look at them apples. And thus the game of Undertale begins. I'll be doing uh, voices for the majority of the characters in here, if not all of the characters in here. So, uh, yeah. I may not always be super consistent with them, so bear with me. That being said, let's get going, guys. Instruction Z or enter to confirm. Cool, cool, cool. It's been a little while, so I'm going to have to re-familiarize myself with how the game works. Begin game. Let's start off with just our name, shall we? Chuddy! Yeah! Whoop. Chunny. Sweet. Done. Is this name correct? Yes, it is. Let's go. Let's have some fun. Woo! <laughs> Undertale! I'm gonna wake up on the bed of flowers. Ooh. It's all dark and snap. What are we gonna do? <laughs> Head off to the right, I suppose. That's the only way we can go, so. <laughs> Ooh, and it's Flowey. Howdy. I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hmm. You're new to the underground, aren't you? Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess little old me will have to do. <laughs> Ready? Here we go. Freaking flowy. <laughs> See that heart? That's your soul, the very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of love. What's love stand for? Why, love, of course! You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. No wink. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can. I'd rather not. Hey, buddy, you missed them. Let's try again, okay? Is this a joke? Are you brain dead? Run into the bullet pellets. <laughs> nope. Ooh, that evil face. You know what's going on here, don't you? You just wanted to see me suffer. And Flowey's vengeance. Die! <laughs> shit. Shit. Oh, nowhere to go. <laughs> Oh, and we're saved, but by who? <laughs> what a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. I'm not the best of female voices, so you guys will have to bear with me. Oh, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come. I will guide you through the catacombs. Okay, sounds good. This way. Let's go. Goat mom, yay! <laughs> uh, just so y'all know, we will be doing the pacifist run uh, to start off. If uh, you guys enjoy the series enough, we'll go ahead and switch over to the genocide run as well later on. But for now, pacifist it is! Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the proper operation of the ruins. Puzzles. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them 
to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Sounds good. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Cool. With uh, more than enough arrows. <laughs> Splendid! I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. Sounds good. The switch doesn't even work. <laughs> then why is it there? As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Seems counterproductive. Stall for a time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Pras practice talking to the dummy. You will come to resolve the conflict. <laughs> what if you're not around? You encounter the dummy. Act. Talk. You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. Toriel seems happy with you. You win! Ah, <laughs> oh, very good. You are very good. Well, I mean, I'd hope so. I'm trying. There's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Well, considering I've played the game before, it's uh, not going to be difficult. And of course, we want to uh, compliment the froggit. Froggit didn't understand what you said. was flattered anyway. Oh, okay. Well... <laughs> <laughs> the tutorial just comes in and mean mugs it off. <laughs> oh, I forgot about that. It's been way too long since I played Undertale. I'm having fun already. This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. It'll lead me through the puzzle as if I can't do it myself. <laughs> now, if I'm not mistaken, if we run back, we'll see a little something. So we'll do that here. Give me a second. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. Do they? Do, 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 do. No? Could have swore we were going to see Flowey. I guess I was wrong. <laughs> you have done excellently thus far, my child. <laughs> However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. No, Goat Mom, don't leave me! <laughs> Where are you going? No! <laughs> Is she ever gonna come back? Are we gonna be alone forever? <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> uh, this fucking game. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Quite a long hallway. I know you're back there. Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Yeah, I saw you, Toriel. You thought you were sneaky. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please, remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. Okay. So you want me just to sit here? <laughs> I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have need for anything, just call. Be good, all right? I will do my best, but and thank you for tossing me a cell phone. Cool. Uh, how do I bring up my menu? There it is. Cell. Uh, let's call her. This is Toriel. You only wanted to say hello? Well then, hello. I hope that suffices. Hee <laughs> hee. Good old Toriel. Cool, cool, cool. This is Toriel. You want to know more about me? Well, I'm afraid there's not much to say. I'm just a silly little lady who worries too much. I don't know, I think there's a lot more to you than that, Toriel. Uh, say hello again. This is Toriel. You want to say hello again? Salutations! Is that enough? Hell no! <laughs> this is Toriel. Are you bored? I should have given a book to you. My apologies! <laughs> Why not use your imagination to divert yourself? Pretend you are a monarch. Rule over the leaf pile with a fist of iron. Can you do that for me? I mean, I can try. I don't know how well it's going to go. <laughs> this is Toriel. Hello, my child. Sorry, I do not have much to say. It was nice to hear your voice, though. Yeah, I bet. Am I annoying you yet? Am I annoying you yet? This is Toriel. Hello, my child. Sorry, I do not have much to say. Okay, so it's, it's going to be on a loop at that point. Okay. I, I thought she was going to get even more uh, upset. <laughs> 
Let's go ahead and, uh, I guess call her mom. This is Toriel. Huh? Did you just call me mom? Yeah, let's go, mom. <laughs> well, I mean, I suppose. Would that make you happy to call me mother? Well then, call me whatever you like. Sounds good to me. Say hello again. <laughs> yeah, I'm a, I'm a chatty Kathy when it comes to telephone calls. Uh, Alright, go ahead and flirt. Oh. Huh? Yeah, that's right, baby. <laughs> oh, heh, heh. Ha 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 ha. How adorable. I could pinch your cheek. You can certainly find better than an old woman like me. Uh, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> Let's see if I can do it again. Oh dear, are you serious? And after you said you wanted to call me mother, you were an interesting child. Well, yeah, have you never heard of what a MILF is? Come on now. <laughs> Everybody knows that. Hello? This is to Oh, now she's calling me. Oh, see, we we're smooth as heck, guys. We're smooth as heck. You've not left the room, have you? Yes, I did. I'm sorry. <laughs> There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try and solve them yourself. Be good, alright? You got it. You got it. Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight you, please use some mercy, human. Ribbit. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is the pacifist playthrough, so we might as well. You can take a piece of candy? Yeah! You take one? Take candy? Yeah! You took more candy, how disgusting. Take one? Yeah! <laughs> you take another piece of candy, you feel like the scum of the earth. <laughs> take one? Yeah! <laughs> you took much too much too fast, the candy spilled onto the floor. No! Clean it up! <laughs> Alright, let's go back out this way, save our game. Playfully clearing, clearing through the leaves fills you with determination. You bet it does. HP fully restored. Hell yeah. Oh, we're gonna get into a battle. It's a Whimson. Uh, they approach meekly. Okay, let's, uh, uh, let's console. Half through your first word, the Whimson bursts into tears and runs away. Oh, Whimson! Poor Whimson. Poor guy. Poor guy. <laughs> All right, well, I guess uh, I guess that'll be the good spot to stop for our first episode. Uh, we'll go ahead and continue through the ruins uh, more so. Well, let's get through this first. Let's go ahead and compliment the frog. It. Toriel kind of gave us a, uh, a a gimme on the first encounter. So, oh, gotta dodge these fireflies. So far, so good. Compliment again. Frog didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. Cool. Blushes deeply. Ribbit, ribbit. Dodge. Mercy. Mercy them, cool. So as you can see, we got a bit of a bullet hell kind of thing going on for combat, which is really, really cool. We'll see a lot more of that later. Uh, a lot more cool enemies and stuff, too. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like on the video if you did indeed like it. Let me know down below what you're thinking of the uh, episode so far. Hopefully, I'll be able to get more of these out pretty soon. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't before and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of these awesome vids. All right, guys, thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time. Take care.